Hello, welcome to Creative Crafting by Katie. I have this thrift store find that I want to flip into something really cute. Just a nice glass bowl, maybe a candy dish, something cute to put your keys or jewelry in. And I want to take these glass paint pens. They're kind of like an acrylic paint pen, but they're for glass. And you can let that set up for nine hours and then put it in a 350 degree oven for 45 minutes to cure the paint. That process will not be shown on this. It will just be me painting. It had a lot of uh, flowers and, and greens on here, leaves and stuff, vines. What I'm doing is taking the, the glass paint pen and coloring in those areas. There was kind of a indentation on there, which helped make it seep in between and it turned out really cool so um, I'm just going around here with a fuchsia on on four of the flowers and I will go on the ends there's two different flowers there so I will go and come back with a like a violet purple and then come in with a real pretty green to finish off with the leaves and the vines and and show you the finished product there are the four here on the top sides and then there's two on the ends and then flip it over and there's one in the very center and I flipped it because that's where they indentations were at and that's why I chose to do it that way instead of on the other side that way it would be able to get into all of the little grooves that are there but super simple project to do it's just like a a paint pen of any sort where you just prime it first and then um just color it in it's super simple and what's nice about this if you get any of this off of the area you don't want you can just easily wipe it off with your finger and it doesn't leave any residue or anything like that so that was really nice I did prep this by just kind of cleaning it off with a baby wipe so that way there wasn't any debris in the area anytime you get something from the thrift store I kind of recommend that you clean it up even if you could use like a rag with alcohol would be helpful as well but nonetheless as long as you just wipe it down and then I dried it with the blow dryer I will set it up with the blow dryer later just to kind of dry this top surface because I want to flip the piece of glass over and I don't want it to uh, bleed off onto the wax paper that I have below and so I do kind of set it up with the hair dryer there and I come back in with a brown and kind of there's a raised dot surface there that looks like the middle of your your petal there where it's kind of a, the seeds would be and I do come in there with that and, and uh, I'll show you that here in a minute with just some little bit of brown on the glass paint there and here's the green that I chose to use I had a couple different green pens but I like this one the best it just gives you a really cool idea of something when you're thrifting you can look around and see what kind of shapes that are on a plate that maybe would really be cool for you to use these paint these uh, paint markers for glass so anyways I think it looks really really cool so far and once you see the finished product you're really gonna love it um, I would love to see pictures of what you guys do and please make sure that you subscribe if you don't already to my page to find more fun filled crafts and, and thrift store flips because I think you guys are going to have lots of cool ideas that you're going to get out of these videos. I like to try to think outside the box and make it different. So enjoy these, these flips and make sure that you hit that subscribe button. See, I just messed up a little bit, so I was able to wipe it off very easily. It's not hard to do at all. And I'm just going to set it up again with the hair dryer after I get these little brown pieces on the middle there. It, it doesn't show much, but it's just like a little bit of contrast for the center. And that's what's cool about it. So, And I got these pink pens for glass off of Amazon which is where I also got my other acrylic paint pens. These are a deco art brand and they do work very well. I do highly recommend them. And there's the finish.